The amount of people in here that have a job they hate and they buy things they don't care about to impress people they don't give a fuck about scares the shit out of me. Many of us uh, have to do things that we don't actually like or love, but deep inside we have something that we really want to do but we cannot do because of the responsibilities and you know we have to have a stable income, we have to do something because we have to blah blah blah. The question is, what are the three activities, the uh, three uh, main goals that you have to set in order to move a step closer towards doing something that you actually love? So it's a really interesting question, and as I was listening, and I hope people are paying attention, (laughs) most people spend money on dumb things, which then forces them to do things they don't want. So step number one for most people in here, they should sell their home, take the money, and go rent. They should return their BMW, and get a Toyota. And that's why, and honestly, that becomes the vulnerability. Why do you own a BMW? Because I love the car, because the brand, and I love driving it, so I don't know. So to me, that's where it gets interesting, right? Do you, or do you like what the brand does to make you look to other people? I don't know, I'm not assuming, I don't know. I know I have a point, I don't know you, but I know in the macro that 98% of people that buy a Mercedes or BMW likes when it makes other people think of them, not that they like it. And that $487 a month versus what they really need, which is $100 a month, is why they have a job they hate because they're paying for a life that means nothing. The amount of people in here that have a job they hate and they buy things they don't care about to impress people they don't give a fuck about scares the shit out of me.